these short little squeegees to work with. How am I supposed to wash my truck window with that short little thing? I had to crawl up on my hood. First thing in the morning, they gave me a short little baby squeegee. Oh well. Did the trick. Did the trick. Alright Sergeant, come on, get you out of there, man. You've only been in there for two seconds, man. Get out of there, man. Get out of there. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. All right. Hey, don't tick off your brother right away. That's a bad way to start the day. Bad way to start the day, man. So we are in St. Lebois, Quebec. Just getting our day going. If you didn't believe me, there's the flag. Where's the Canada flag, you might ask? I have the same question. I don't know. But we're in Quebec, so they fly Quebec flags. It's a nice flag. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the flag. But they leave out the Canada flag. Never see that in Manitoba. Just driving through Robertsonville here, near Thetford, Bi Thetford Mines, Quebec. It must be garage sale day, because like every third house has a garage sale going on. Garage sales here, garage sales there, another garage sale over here, or a yard sale, whatever you call it. It's sell your junk day. I love those days. Bit of a rainy day today. Not gonna lie. At least it's not raining, it's more just so misting. More so just misting. Makes everything very green when it rains like this. We're still here in Quebec, looks like we're coming up to Valais Junction, Junction, Valais Junction. Valais 1.2 kilometers, turn left on Rue Principale, then turn right. 50 kilometers an hour. I hate it when they adjust the speed limit slower on the downhill. Come on, I want to go fast. Now I got to use my brakes. So, welcome to this little French town. Bonjour. Bonjour. Zalou. What does Zalou mean? It means hello, right? People keep coming up to me and saying, Zalou. Like, Hi. I don't speak your language, but let's be friends. Okay, here's a whole oh, narrow little bridge. This will be fun. Look at this. Look at this. Interesting design. Oh, of course, we got to meet somebody on here. Of course. Well, at least it's not a truck. What do they all got here? I can't read any of the signs, so I have no idea. I just follow the pictures. See? Quebec. Turn left on Rue Principale, then turn right. Quebec, that away. Alright. Well, let's not park on the railway tracks. See that sign off on the right there? It says Sur la voie. Ferré, via Ferré. I'm assuming that means do not park on the railway tracks. You know, like common sense, stuff like that. Nice church right ahead of us here. I noticed that the French, they really take care of their churches. Like they're very, very nice. In every little town, every little town has this massive church and it's always like ancient. Well, not ancient, but you know, it was built a long time ago, but they maintain it. Very nice. Bonjour, bonjour. Bonjour to you too, bonjour. Bonjour, nice car. Uh, nice, 
How do you say, lay nice car? Turn right on Boulevard Ducap. I turn right here now? Are you kidding me? Over here? I'm gonna have to take the whole road up to get around this corner here. Well, it looks like they got highway trains here in Quebec as well. Except in Quebec and Ontario, they gotta put this silly sign at the back here. It says train. As if people passing, you couldn't figure that out. But hey, whatever makes them feel better. Hey, whatever. Someone somewhere once thought that it would make traffic safer, so we'll go with it. Well, that guy was so short, man, you could barely see over the steering wheel. What are you doing driving a big truck? You had to be like under four feet tall. Look at where my next drop is, guys. It's way on the edge of Eastern Quebec there. Let's zoom out a little bit so you can see this a bit better. One for us. See that right there is Maine. This is Quebec. That's uh, New Brunswick. We're going right to the eastern little edge of uh, southeast Quebec there. I don't know that's southeast Quebec, but that's east Quebec. I've never been there before. It's a town called Pabos. Pabos. And it's not very big, but we're going to Pabos. Almost sounds like a Spanish name. Pabos. I sort of said that like an Italian. Pabos, eh? We gotta go on to Pabos, eh? No, it's uh. I don't know how you say that in French. Le Pabot? Le Pabot? Probably Pabot. Pabot. Pabot, Pabot, Pabot. Pabot. We're off to Pabot. I just called them. We're six hours away still, so we're gonna get there like after they close tonight. Uh, but they open up at 9 a.m. tomorrow on Saturday, so we're gonna deliver it first thing in the morning. And then from there, we head over to Truro, Nova Scotia, and we'll probably sit there till Monday. I'm guessing. I don't know if I should get a reset then or not. I'll figure it, out, figure it out, but in Truro, I'm guessing they're not open on Sundays, so we'll deliver Monday, and then we'll head to the ferry. We'll be at the ferry Monday night. Hopefully, we won't cross over during the night. I'm thinking if I get there Monday night, I'm thinking I'll probably be on the Tuesday afternoon ferry, and I can show you it during the day. I'm going to periscope from the ferry, though you probably <coughs> you probably already saw it, though. <clears throat> Apparently, I need something to drink. realize I should probably put some fuel in the truck. We're going out to the middle of nowhere in eastern Quebec and this is the last fuel stop. Good thing I realized that before I went blowing past it. Thank you Petro Pass for being where I need you to be. It's just a little card log. It's nothing special but it's special to me. <laughs> I would have come pretty well I wouldn't have come close to running out of fuel but I would have gone lower than I feel comfortable going with. I don't like running with that kind of worry and stress and whatnot. It ruins the day. All right, let's get some fuel here. I'm on a dirt road. Look at me, I'm on a dirt road. We had to take a detour. The main road was getting fixed, so they put us on a detour and... Continue 2.7 kilometers, then turn left on Route Ross. Thank you, Maddie, but I got this. What do you do when the only paved road is getting fixed. You gotta take the gravel road. Nice little area in here though, eh? Not too shabby. Thank you. 
So glad to be done the day. We are in Bonaventure, Quebec. Bonaventure. Bonaventure, Quebec. Something like that. And uh, about an hour away from where we gotta unload in the morning. I'm gonna drive the rest in the morning. Uh, I gotta do a little bit of physical work when I get there, so the hour drive will give me a chance to wake up on the way there, so I'll be awake and alert, you know? Because I sit down here for a while first, I eat my breakfast, I make sure I'm awake, obviously, and then I drive down the road, and then by the time I get there, I'll be ready to work. You know what I mean? Absolutely. My logic. Huh? We'll see you tomorrow, guys. Don't forget down below in the description, check out the links, click them if you feel like it. Don't forget to subscribe on the YouTube channel, follow me on Periscope, and all the other little things down below. I'll see you tomorrow, anytime after 4 a.m. Central.